Papa Sue was born and officially launched in October 2017 with a vision to make the world with and for girls. Four years on, Papa Sue continues to grow as the world's first African rooted up for girls organizing and activism, centering the political power of girls activists in Sierra Leone and around the world. So all our work is about redistributing power assets, building collective power, organizing power holders, and transforming power structures. With our global fund, the With and for Girls Fund, the world's first African rooted global fund for girls, we have funded over 420 groups in over 100 countries with over $4 million. In Sierra Leone, our Karakura grants have supported over 30 grassroots and girl-led organizations across Sierra Leone to run girl-only safe spaces, facilitate life skill sessions, and spark a groundswell of girls to imagine new possibilities for themselves and their communities. We partnered with Global Fund for Human Rights to create a special grants designed and decided upon by young people for young people. Takura has provided direct financial support to 17 groups in seven districts across Sierra Leone. When the corona outbreak struck, we knew girls and girl activists would need resources. We convened and facilitated the Global Resilience Fund, mobilizing many international donors to provide direct cash support to over 230 groups across 91 countries around the world. A revolution requires building collective power, and we are supporting the movement to raise consciousness and nurture solidarity through various initiatives. Girl Circles, using girl-only safe spaces, radio and girl-led collective advocacy campaigns to catalyze transformational change in girls' lives. Through this initiative, we're supporting over 15,000 girls and 700 mentors across six districts in Sierra Leone. The Kaurukura Connection. When corona struck and prevented girls from gathering in their circles, we doubled down our efforts to reach girls by creating virtual safe space for adolescent girls through our Kaurukura Connection radio show and the Kaurukura Comping Drama, reaching girls with safety and life skills information a mixture of factual and fictional radio content aired on over 35 radio stations in every district across Sierra Leone. Our dynamic teams became producers, actors, singers and radio hosts, driving the production of the Karakura Connection show and the Karakura Comping Drama. To access this content, we distributed radios and Bluetooth speakers across girls-only safe spaces in Sierra Leone, and we put smartphones in the hands of 700 young female mentors. This means mentors and girls could access this life-saving content and open possibilities for us to hear directly from them about the impact of the pandemic in their communities. To create the world we imagine for girls, we know we must also fight, plan, mobilize, strategize and finance our vision for a new world. We host and support the Salon Adolescent Girls Network, a group of over 150 grassroots community and international actors working to give girls their full power in Sierra Leone. When a rape crisis captured the imagination of Sierra Leoneans and others across the world, we mobilized our partners and launched the Survivors Solidarity Fund. A collective effort raised local resources and together fights to end rape and all forms of violence in our lifetime. In just over one month, we raised a record-breaking $1 billion and $46 million through individuals and private donations to directly support organizations providing life-saving and life-sustaining services for survivors of rape and sexual penetration. We know that girls cannot have power if policy, laws, customs, and structures continue to hold them down. We work with girls, mentors, and allies to transform power structures for girls. To fight against the unjust ban on pregnant girls from school in Sierra Leone, we convened and worked with the Coalition for Girls Education, an alliance of 30 organizations working for the radical inclusion of girls in education. With the Coalition, we led efforts that successfully ended the ban on pregnant schoolgirls in Sierra Leone. After the ban was lifted, Purposeful 
co-chaired the working group convened by the Ministry of Basic and Senior Secondary Education, and we led in drafting the Radical Inclusion in Education Policy, a progressive milestone policy guaranteeing access to education for all girls, including pregnant and parent learners, children with disabilities, and those in poor and rural communities. Finally, a landmark victory for girls in Sierra Leone. We are working to end all forms of violence against girls, including female genital mutilation and cutting. FGM is a form of violence against women and girls, affecting over 90% of the female population. With our Watikura initiative, we're building on the momentum of this movement and laying the foundation for the ultimate goal of eradicating female genital mutilation and cutting through, among other things, the passage and enforcement of a national law that bans the cutting of women and girls. Purposeful research the drivers of child marriage in Sierra Leone and Guinea. We released Weathering the Storm, a global report that lifts up the hopes dreams and realities of young activists organizing against the backdrop of the COVID-19 pandemic. And we center our own health, joy and healing in our work. This year, we started the Feminist Wellness Academy to facilitate individual and group wellness, healing from all the ways we're affected by the systems we're trying to overturn. Only four years and a global team based in different corners of the world. We have done all of this while dancing, laughing, playing, eating, and yes, taking radical rest. Hashtag joy as resistance. Join the movement. Visit www.wearepurposeful.org.